you know, realize it was a freak thing and not, you know, my doing. So, you know, I, I've, I've moved on and forgave myself on that aspect. Um, obviously, still think about um, Justin on a daily basis whenever I get into a race car and, you know, always pray for his family. Um, I think it's pretty cool that I get to start next to his brother for the race. Um, me and Steph, you know, we, we've had a few conversations, you know, since the accident. And we're on really, you know, we're on good terms. And, um, you know, he, he's reached out to me and, and has assured me that, like, you know, anybody that was in my position at Pocono would have been doing the same exact thing. And what happened was a freak accident, and it's not my fault. And uh, to hear that from him, I think, was one of the, like, the last little healing things I needed to have was, you know, somebody from Justin's family, you know, push me further into the process. And that's what he did for me. 